Hello, fish fam. Uh, it's been a while since I've been on. I want to apologize you guys for that, but uh, it's been it's been pretty busy. I figure I give you give you guys an update on my tanks and uh, just show you just show you stuff. I have I have ideas in my head what I'd like to do, but right now since I'm busy with remodeling the house and stuff like that, I haven't been really been able to do much, but. I've just been maintaining tanks, buying fish here and there. I have other tanks I want to set up, but that's just going to have to wait for a little bit. But all right, here we go. I'm going to show you the the, the tanks that I have. I added one tank, and I'll update you on all the tanks. All right, here we go. Okay, update on the 20-gallon. Now, I got three handlers in here. Uh, I uh, purchased them off a local fish store. I had three originally and uh it was that female and that male and it was a little baby well come to find out when it grew up it was another male so i put it down in the community tank and then i went and got another female so that the other female ain't too stressed out so i got a trio now i'm not too sure what uh kind they are these things move so much i don't have one of them expensive cameras to get a good picture of them but he, he has like blue color in him, you know, white, white tail. Uh, and uh, I got two Corys in here. I think I got a male and a female. Albino Pleco is doing good. I have two of them. And the Clown Pleco, which is going to be hard to see because one of them hides underneath the filter. And then there's one right here. I do believe I have a male and female pair. Not too sure about the bristle nose yet. But uh, I was thinking about adding something else in here, but I ain't too sure. I just might keep it that way. I might get some guppy grass or something, and that'll be it. Uh, when I got the handlers, the one female, she she ended up having babies, and I'm going to show them to you next. And she must be a different one because they're a totally different color than this male because I don't think they're his babies. So, all right, on to that tank. So here's the tank gallon. This is the baby she ended up having. They're all female. They're all males, but one. And uh, they're this pretty red color. It's hard to I'm trying to get it to focus. And uh, I'm not too sure what kinds they are, but I think they're pretty. So she ended up having a total of uh, let's see here, one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven. There's another one in here, but it's hiding somewhere. Uh, all my shrimp ended up dying on me. I don't know what I did wrong, but uh, that, that's part of it, I guess. So yeah, they're all males, but one. So I gotta pull her. I'm gonna, I'm gonna call, I'm gonna call the males out. You know, figure out which one I really want. I think looks the nicest and I'll let them two in there to breed make make more of these nice redfish and then whenever I get a bunch of them I'll build another family in another tank all right we're gonna move on to the 55 now and I have another tank down there to show you also alrighty here we go all right here's the 55 uh, the changes that were in this since the last video it's is the I moved the the baby sword tails down in here uh, they're actually grown pretty quickly uh, and I moved her down because she was the only one that survived from it uh, and I want to say that that's all I added here oh no I didn't I added a uh, male ender from I said about the trios that I got it was a baby and then it ended up being a male so I didn't want to stress the female out too much so I put them down here but other than that I haven't really done much with the tank just making sure it stays clean and stuff like that the crypts are doing pretty good I have one that floats around this thing ends up going into the filter there I'll have to fix that but other than that everything's been doing good in the tank uh, gotta get that algae off the front but I just did a water change a little bit ago, and I must have missed this spot. Well, all right, on to the next. 
Was this right here was a birthday gift that was given to my daughter uh, from one of her aunts. It's a red bait of fish, just something a little simple. But he ain't going to be staying in here long. Uh, he's been in here for uh, about a month now. Did one water change. He eats the, the pellets and stuff, but I'm probably going to get something different for him to eat. Because I'm going to move him over to the five and a half gallon because both of the, the puffer fishes died. Just one thing happened. I fed them and everything was good. They just did everything I was supposed to. They just passed away. All right. I want to thank everybody for watching my video today. I appreciate everybody viewing. I know it's been a while since I've been on. But there will be more to come hopefully in the future. Thank you for watching. Bye.